the Seychelles Islands, near the East African coast. We're gonna see beautiful beaches today, but first, a quick recap. In the previous video, we started our road trip through the Mahe Island and already visited four amazing beaches. You wanna see it? Click here to check it out. And in today's video, we're continuing a road trip and visit the Anzintendans and Police Beach, which wasn't really what we expected. Are you ready? Let's go. We've already stopped at three beaches. They were all beautiful. Now we're walking to Ans Antendans, something like that. It's one of the most famous beaches where they say you have to go. It's one of the most beautiful beaches in the world. So we are just 20 feet away. Let's see. I can already see the sea there. how amazing this is guys wow yes this beach is so beautiful and it is not crowded at all i think this is definitely one of the best beaches i've been to in my life and of course i had to try the water After spending a good hour here on the beach, we walk back to our car to continue our road trip. We're heading to another famous beach, Police Bay. And it's actually very close, just a 13 minute drive. Okay guys, now it's time to walk to the Police Bay beach. We parked the car a little bit up the hill there and we're walking along the sea and it is so beautiful. There's so many palm trees here. And palm trees are my favorite trees. In Tyrona Park in Colombia, I also have a travel vlog about that place. You had also a park full, full of palm trees. It was the most beautiful thing ever. But this is gonna be even more beautiful than that place. I'm gonna tell you. This is meant to be one of the most beautiful beaches of Seychelles. Oh, this is so cool. This path walk is in the middle of nowhere, in the jungle. Dale. Dale. <laughs> wow. We're getting there. Almost there. Hold on. Hang on. And it's good temperature too. Ooh, I think it's like 25, 27. It's not humid. Well, it's kind of humid, but I'm okay with it. I feel like I'm in Expedition Robinson. It's a Dutch TV show. And they have to survive on an island like this. And it really looks like this. This is just wild palm trees. Wow. Here we are, Police Bay. It's a sea turtle's nesting site. Let's see if we can find some. It's right there, guys. Right there. Where is everyone? Wow, this is beautiful. We're the only ones on this beach. There's no one. How is that possible? There's so many tourists on this whole island. This is one of the most famous beaches. And there's no one. <laughs> it's just us with water. Fiesta. Well, that's nice. The current is very strong and the waves are very high, so I don't think we're gonna try the water now. I guess we'll just be looking at it. My hair is doing crazy things. Wow, crazy. <laughs> Well, I'm a bit disappointed with this beach, to be honest. The one we were just now, I don't know the name, but I'll put it down in the in the video and in the description as well. It's way more beautiful, honestly. This is super beautiful, don't get me wrong, but the other one where we just were does not have this strong current. We cannot really go in the water because the current is way too strong. It's too dangerous, right? They have signs everywhere, like swimming at your own risk and stuff. So Salo is now just watching the waves a little bit close up, but um, no, we're not going in for a swim here. It is beautiful, we're the only ones, but I think that is the reason why we are the only ones. You know, the, the current is just too strong. These waves are huge, but it's it's a little bit too dangerous. I'm pretty hungry, so we're gonna go take the car around the island towards the airport and then drive back home. We kind of miss the north part of the island, but I'm gonna see and ask Salo if we can maybe drive around a little bit to still see some of the northern part of the island, because that's also beautiful, I'm telling you. But as far as this beach, it's really nice, but the current is very strong, so I'll advise you to go to the beach that I've shown previously. All right, now it's time to have some food. They love their fast food here. Fish and chips, and he got prawns and chips. Nice, delicious. 
I think it's been 10 years, honestly, since I've had fish and chips in London. I had it with my mom and my sister and my brother. So I'm very curious, actually. It looks good. Fried, fried fish. <laughs> Fresh fish from the sea right here. Well, wow. Oh, nice. How are your shrimps? They're good. Nice. This place was reviewed a 4.9 on Google Maps, and yeah, the food was really good. Now we're driving towards another famous beach to make a quick stop. This little yellow monster is bringing us everywhere. Amazing. This is Anzoyal. Also beautiful, but a bit more rocky. You don't see it now though, but the closer we get to the airport, the more traffic appears on the streets. And that's probably because all the tours are finished at 4 o'clock. So, and it's 4.45 now, so everyone is driving home, you know, from all the, all the sites. We're driving towards the airport, so I think a lot of people also work there. Maybe the people on this island work until 4 instead of 5. That could be nice. An island schedule. Amazing. This is Victoria, the capital of Seychelles. Doesn't it look cute? Well, there's another traffic jam that's not so cute. We had an hour delay due to traffic around the airport, but now we're making our way to the northern part of the island. We have to drive a little bit faster though, because we want to see the sunset from the beach in front of our hotel. Hopefully we will be in time. The roads on these islands are not so wide and they don't have lights that go on at night. So you can imagine, we want to be in our hotel before dark, because otherwise you can literally see nothing. Well, we're almost arriving, and I'm gonna tell you, the sunsets are gonna be amazing. Listen to this. We're freshly showered back at the hotel, and we're walking to the beach right now, because we wanna see the sunset. We don't wanna miss it this time. Hopefully, we're gonna get an amazing sunset. Yesterday was nice though, but today is gonna be better, I'm sure. And I brought my 0, 0.0 beer. They also have it here, and it's just one euro per bottle. It's super cheap compared to all the other drinks that you can buy in the store. Well, it's just two minutes. We'll be there. Mmm. It tastes just like regular beer, honestly. Oh, guys, we just missed it. Literally just missed it. But it's still beautiful. Wow. Cheers, Salo. Cheers. To a great day yeah, of beach hopping. It's so beautiful. And do you remember these? They're all over the place. They're huge. It has been an amazing day. We spent our last hour at the beach. Let's see what tomorrow is gonna bring us. I can literally touch the ceiling. <laughs> That was crazy. We saw a turtle just now in the water, but unfortunately 